Hello, hi. Mercury retrograde. This is the last one of the year. It's if you're a little bit aware, it's already starting. Is your Mercury shadow stuff starting to hit the fan and you're having restless nights? You're wondering what is this stuff that's waking you up at night? And I want to tell you with this Mercury, there's something to know. It's a little bit of a reversal of fortune and it's opposite day. What I mean by that is while it has a distinct, uh, for those of you who follow tarot, and tarot is not going to do your light body, but um, eight of cups energy. It's either going to be reversed for you or it's going to be upright. And what that means is you're either moving forward or you're staying stuck with some stuff. But here's the key. What are you walking away from? And here's another key. Pay attention to your own priorities. Pay attention to you, your priorities, and not the world. This is a very, very introverted type of energy. You should find yourself in monk mode, hermit mode, and we are doing this right around the new moon energy. This is for your growth. This is like deep growth, especially for those of us in the Northern Hemisphere. This is when you have to get your roots where they belong at the heart. How do you do that? I have the ways to do that. Because people think that this is so simple, and I make it as simple as possible, but it is a process, okay? It is a process. Part of the process is, from now on, pay attention to your new light body. Because if you don't, you will get garbled messages. You will feel like this is a cult. You will feel forces that feel like they're telling you to give up. And there's no force. What you're feeling is the general collective you're going to feel once again that you're on the losing end of history somehow you're yet again once again alone for the holidays and it really hurts or rejected rejected fail okay please stop feeling like a failure you have to be able to help yourself with this so what is your shadow stuff write it to me put it down is some of your shadow stuff the bumps in the night and you're like going but I'm a good person I don't deserve this let me know what's going on and even better you see that sign there have a coaching have some coaching to get you on track with this because there is usually a deeper theme that you're needing to address and we help you discern that and we also help you to feel empowered we are teaching people how to fish because we are about the love okay make love not war that is the message of twin flames if you're not riding and staffing the you know what out of this thing and each other then maybe you don't know what i'm talking about but it's time to learn then okay it's time to get your dimensional footholds it's time to get your connection to 5d so that you thrive because that old paradigm is closing. But are you ready for a new paradigm? This shadow period is going to show you what are some of your shadowy things. What That means what are your weaknesses? What are your weaknesses versus your priority? We have the holidays. We have a new year. We have a solstice. Around this time of year, people overindulge. Is that one of your weaknesses? What can you do about it? Aha. Uh -huh. Join my juicing transformation class in January. We'll get that going. We'll get it working. And we'll get your skin glowing and we'll get that freshly loved feeling into you. Exuding from you. That's what it's about. Love. Love. Love from everywhere. Where the universe loves and supports you. And it really feels like that. You start feeling like you can be other people's angel and you start feeling like you're really a part of the angelic human tribe that is waking up here. doesn't matter where you're from. You're here bringing it, being a vessel, channeling it, creating the new stuff. Okay. Now maybe that sounds vague. I talk a lot in my webinars and classes about 
the things people have created just from the inspirations from their higher self, the means to do so, and the doors that open for them. So if you're feeling stuck and like you're just treading water and you're dreading another year of this, let this retrograde be the time in this shadow to help you out of that rut, to help you out of that quicksand, and to help you really learn and grow. And that means expand, because if you can't expand your light body, you will feel very stuck and you won't feel like you're being fed the love, okay? You won't feel like you're holding the love and you will run out of energy and juice for other people. You will run out of it for your own responsibilities. So take some cues here, take some hints from the things that are happening for you. And like I say, make this Mercury the opposite day. Yay, in a good way. Hope to see you there. I'm located in Chicago. I am a genuine Blu-ray Twin Flame prototyper union, union, Twin Flame Union. Yes, and proud to be so. I'm proud of all my work over the past 15 years. Thank you so much. Bye.